The largest agricultural fair in Pennsylvania continues tonight at the Crawford County Fairgrounds, and there is still plenty of time to check out everything going on at the fair. Erie News Now, Jamison Hicksonbaugh joining us live from the fairgrounds with a look at some of the festivities that are happening tonight. Good evening, Jamison. Good evening. We've been here since about 2 o'clock this afternoon, and I got to tell you, it's literally a perfect day here at the Cropper County Fairgrounds. And this is the 79th year of the event, and for many people, it's become an annual tradition. If you look behind me, you can see we have a decent sized crowd here so far. A lot of people out here at this hour kind of checking out the animals, all the other exhibits, and maybe grabbing a bite to eat at one of the many food vendors. And joining me right now to talk a little bit more about this year's event is the board president, Dean Maynard. Thanks so much for joining us, Dean. You're welcome. Thanks for coming down. Absolutely. It's a great day out here. A lot of people here. Just kind of talk about how this year's event's been going so far for you. Well, we were off to a little bit of a wet start over the weekend. We began on Saturday. Uh, it didn't really dampen the spirits of anybody. We had a pretty full house on Saturday, a little less on Sunday, and then some of that heavy, funky fog we had on Monday uh, took us through the day. Uh, we, we've had good crowds. We've had great events. Today we had our first ever mullet contest, which you were a part of. Was part of that. won entries on, on the first year. Packed house to watch it. So now we're doing great things and having good things with our local people and all of our guests. What are your thoughts on that competition? I know Amanda Post and I had to judge it. It was uh, something else. I'll never win it, I know that, <laughs> but uh, I think the kids that entered were having a, fu a fun time. The one little boy came across on a little scooter and very creative and just, it, it was fun to watch. You and me both, my friend, and I will ask you just uh, how important is this event, not only for the, the, the board and everybody, just for this community as a whole to have something like this? I think it's one of the best things that Crawford County does, even for the, the Tri-County area as well. Uh, we set the bar pretty high too and we work, we work up to it. A lot of local county fairs come down and visit us. To, we learn from each other. We've partnered with them in the last three years. And the best part of this fair is the business partners that we have across this community. Erie Bank, you'll see, is our sponsor for today. And uh, they joined us for the day. They gave out free prizes. Erie News Now is a, a partner of ours. You guys have been here. Uh, just looking around, everybody works together. It all comes together with the weather, you know, nicely. Uh, it's just a great place to make just uh, make Meadville a destination. Absolutely a wonderful event. Appreciate your time. Thanks so You're much welcome. for joining us. Fair's going to be coming up. It's going to be going until 10 o'clock tonight.